गुड मॉर्निंग डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल वेलकम बैक टू माय प्रीमियम क्लासेस होप यू ऑल आर सेफ इनसाइड योर होम एंड होप यू ऑल आर सब्सक्राइब शेयर एंड लाइक माय चैनल ओके सो टुडे वी विल नो अबाउट लिविंग थिंग्स एंड नॉन लिविंग थिंग्स ओके so uh, some for some of uh, you it will be so uh, for some of you maybe it is very easy for them to uh, watch to differentiate uh, living things and non living things but for some of you it will not be easy maybe they are confused actually there they can be confused also like if plants are living things and plants can make their food then why mushroom cannot make their own food okay if animal is a living thing then why animal cannot make its own food there are some confusion today i will clear all your doubts okay and still if you have any doubt you will have any doubt then you can write in my comment section below okay so uh, let me give you one example uh, my dear children when you wake up in the morning okay when you wake up in the morning you see when you open your eyes you see so many things so many uh, the number of non living things is more than the living things okay uh, some of them are uh, nature's made and some of them are human made like the sun the moon the stars all these are natural but the chair table bed these are all human made but, but both uh, both are uh, what both are non living things but uh, when your mom serve you breakfast your mom is living thing okay so it is uh, very easy i will let you know about some characteristics by which it will be very easy for you all to organize or to know which are living things and which are non living things okay so my dear student let us know about some characteristics of living things which will make you which will make your doubt clear okay so there are some characteristics by which it will be easy for us to differentiate between the living things and the non living things the first characteristics is living things move on their own living things move on their own means living things actually i am excluding the uh, for the handicap part okay they are our special child they are our special human beings let us exclude them but uh, except them all human beings uh, can move uh, by their own they don't need anyone support if they are feeling hungry they can make their own food by moving if uh, they have to bring something they can bring uh, by moving okay if the uh, human beings can find their own shelter human can uh, human being can make their own food okay so human beings does not need anyone support like that the animals they also don't need anyone support they can move by their own okay but the non living things do not move on their own okay uh, means uh, if i will uh, if i uh, i will uh, what if i will uh, put this mobile phone if i will put this mobile phone here okay here till i will not move it it cannot move by its own self i have to move it okay so non living things cannot move by their own so living thing apne hisab se move kar sakte hain non living things move nahi kar sakte theek hai this is the first characteristics the second characteristics is living things need air food and water okay if now i now if now i will feel hungry i must have some food okay if i will not have this uh, air water and food then i cannot survive i will die living things will die if they don't get this food in a balanced amount they need all of this in a balanced amount they can't only survive by having food they cannot only survive by having water they need all the three things in a balanced amount but the non living things they don't care about rain they don't care about water air and food okay they don't need all of this so living things ko khana peena aur एयर ये तीनों चीज चाहिए बट नॉन लिविंग थिंग्स डू नॉट नीड ऑल ऑफ दिस नॉन लिविंग थिंग्स को ये सारा चीज नहीं चाहिए दिस इज द सेकेंड कैरेस्टरिस्टिक्स ओके तो लिविंग थिंग्स कैन मेक देयर ओन फूड लाइक द प्लांट्स ओके प्लांट्स कैन मेक देयर ओन फूड बाई यूजिंग द 
chlorophyll the plants have one green substance which is known as chlorophyll okay the green part is known as chlorophyll because of which the plants can make their own food okay but the animals cannot make their own food they depend on others for their food okay but plants uh, take sun uh, sunlight from sun water from soil air from uh, carbon dioxide from air and make its own food okay plants do not need any one cell the process by which plants make its own food is known as photosynthesis if someone will ask you what do you mean by photosynthesis he will answer the process by which plant makes its own food is known as photosynthesis okay so uh, but the mushroom cannot make its own food uh, why mushroom cannot make its own food because mushroom do not have with the uh, green substance the chlorophyll mushroom do not have that part okay that's why mushroom cannot make its own food uh, but uh, how then how did uh, how does uh, mushroom survive mushroom collects its own uh, own nutrients mushroom collects its own nutrients from the dead plants and animals mushroom grows mushroom grows on the dead plants and animals and from them only from that part only from the dead plants and animals only mushroom collects its nutrients okay so we know in this characteristics that plant and human being can make their own food um, uh, plants make its own food because of the chlorophyll mushroom do not have chlorophyll that's why it collects its nutrient from the dead plants and animals where it grows and animals depend on plants or other animals for their own food okay this is the second characteristic now let's go to the third characteristic which is living things made up of cell okay a cell is a substance a cell is a living a cell is the smallest living part of a living things a cell is the smallest living part of a living things okay uh, so as you know drops of uh, drops of water makes uh, can make a sea okay when the drops of water came together they can make a they can form a sea like that our body contains millions of cells our body body is made up of cells only but my uh, and animals body also made up of cell and plants body also made up of cell but the cells are different okay and um, uh, some uh, some what some living things body is made up of one cell only like the amoeba and some living things made up uh, some living things body is made up of thousands of cell like our body okay so uh, and if you want to see a living if you want to see cells uh, then you have to use a microscope you cannot see them in your naked eyes okay you have to use microscope to see then the fourth which is living things grow and change okay uh, acha when i was in standard 5 or when i was in montessori i am com i look completely di not 100% different but 90% different okay my look changed my weight changed my height changed okay my body structure changed so we look different as we grown up okay i our height increased our weight increased after few years few times we became adult okay our body our body structure changed all the living things okay like when you plant a seed okay when you plant a seed the seed became a plant then the plant later later the plant became a large tree okay and gives us fruits wood air oxygen so many things okay so like that we also when we become an adult our structure our body also change so living things grow and change so let's go to the fifth living things they respond to change okay when uh, when we feel hot okay let me give one ex example when we feel hot what do we do generally we on the fan or we on the ac okay um, so uh, we feel hot and we responded by uh, by uh, what by switching on the ac or switching on the fan okay when one mosquitoes bite us okay what do we do what do we do suddenly our hand goes like this and try to bitten up the mosquito okay Uh, so this is our respond uh, like that animals respond to the changes in their in their environment okay animal also respond and when you um, uh, so how does a plant react 
hope you all know about the toshmi knot plant what does it do when you touch the leaves of a toshmi knot plant it closes it close close their leaves okay when you touch the leaves of a toshmi knot plant it closes their leaves okay this is his uh, this is the reaction of that plant okay but the non living things cannot sense anything they don't have any response whatever you can do means if you will broken of a mobile phone or if you will broken or if you will break your laptop also then also the laptop and mobile phone do not have any reaction the loss will be your only okay because they are non living things and they don't have any sense organ to respond okay now the most important thing which is living things reproduce okay now i am sitting here recording this video because of my parents only because of the reproduction of my parents only like that all all living things reproduce the same uh, the same species means uh, a human being reproduce a human being a plant reproduce a plant and animals reproduce a animal an animal so some animals reproduce by laying eggs some birds reproduce by laying eggs and some uh, some directly give birth to babies okay but all living things reproduce plants reproduce through their spores okay plants reproduce through their spores but the non living things do not reproduce okay a table cannot reproduce a table a mobile phone cannot reproduce a mobile phone okay so uh, living things reproduce but the non living things cannot reproduce okay i hope you all understood acha like that you um, animals also respond okay uh, when uh, a dog uh, if uh, one dog is barking and if you will uh, throw a stone what what uh, what will be the reaction of the dog he will run away okay he will uh, that dog will run away okay uh, like that uh, human beings plants and animals all the living things responds to their uh, to the situation uh, when the acha when the teacher try to give one uh, give one slap okay when the teacher try to give uh, give one slap what did we do we just touch our face or we just do like this we go backward yes or no like that my dear children uh, all living things respond okay so uh, this is the first session uh, the in the next session i will tell you about the growing of stages uh, some different reproduction of plants and so many things so we will learn in the next session uh, for today this much only Uh, if you have liked my video, then please like, uh, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to share and uh, please watch the full video. Thank you so much, and uh, thank you so much those who have already subscribed my premium classes. Okay.